Okay, um, this was actually a question I, uh, a student had. So what this is, is basically, you can see all my material slots are, are taken up here. And they're all applied to a particular material in here. Now, with 3D Studio Max um, in the uh, compact editor slot, like I'm, I've been doing here, um, you don't have just 24 materials. The, the materials are unlimited. It's just it only shows 24 at a time. And so to um, say you pick, you pick a material, um, it doesn't matter what it is, and say you want to reset it. So if you look here, I just picked uh, uh, one of the materials, and I'm going to just hit the, the reset map. And it'll ask you if you want to reset the map in the scene or only in the editor slot. So if you only do the editor slot, you can say OK. And notice this is the same material here. It didn't change at all. Now, so you can do it that way. That's one way to do it. Um, and if you need that material back or if you want to edit that material back, it's not gone. You just have to go here and pick the material from the object. And then you choose the object here and the material is back in the editor slot. Okay, and that's and that's fairly simple. But say you you're happy with all these objects right here, and you want to completely dump um, your material slots so you can work on a whole new set of materials. It's go into the utilities, and you can reset the editor slots, and it pretty much gives you a whole new section. Now again, in the same aspect, say you decide, okay, you know what, I've been working on this and I don't like this material, so I want to go back in and change it. Again, you can go pick from material from object, choose your material, and it pretty much will come back. Um, now this one you can't see. Let me do a different one. Um, that one's actually got a, a transparency on there. So you can just pick this one, and there, there's your material back. So you're not limited to the 24 slots um, in the material editor. You can do as many as you want. You're just only limited to 24 visible slots. Um, and that's, that's pretty much the, the basis of this tutorial. I hope that helps.